Hey there, I'm Akanksha Swaroop. Now the 20th National Congress of the Chinese Communist Party is all set to begin on October 16th. This meet will set the tone for China's next five years under Xi Jinping's leadership yet again. Now Xi's bid for a third term became apparent in March 2018. This is when China's legislature approved a constitutional amendment that removed term limits on the position of China's president. And that means Xi Jinping could be China's president for life. Now here are six things to know about the significance of Xi's upcoming CCP Congress. First and foremost, the party congress is shrouded in secrecy. Public awareness of the event is basically limited to only its location and whatever information that the CCP doles out, that too via the state media. Beyond that, the specific agenda remains a mystery. To put it more simply, what happens in Beijing's Great Hall of the People remains in the Great Hall of the People. What should be noted is that Xi Jinping's trip to the recently held Shanghai Cooperation Organization Summit in Uzbekistan was his first post-pandemic trip. It reflected a very high level of confidence of the Chinese president, one who knows that he's here to stay. The CCP's Central Committee resolution in November last year enshrined him on par with Mao and Deng Xiaoping. It gives him the status of a historical figure, someone who's critical to China's growing wealth and power. In fact, Xi's authoritarian regime has been powered by China's four-decade economic boom. So much so, his inequality campaign has ensured that Chinese tech mega firms like Tencent and Alibaba donate billions of dollars. This to common prosperity initiatives only to demonstrate corporate submission to Xi's economic agenda. And even though the Chinese president has exercised total control over the state, there are still challenges ahead for Xi Jinping. Xi's goal of economic, diplomatic and military dominance have already placed China in direct conflict with US President Joe Biden's administration's commitment to democracy, human rights and a rules-based international order. After the former US President Donald Trump's exit, the US-China relations have gone downhill. Trade tensions, recent Chinese military intimidation of Taiwan and the UN report on Xinjiang coupled with the US accusations of genocide in Xinjiang have only added to Xi Jinping's headaches. So when Xi emerges from the 20th Party Congress, the Chinese leader will have no time for a victory lap. And that's because China's economy is plagued by worrying signs already. Xi's zero-COVID strategy has fueled unemployment. So much so, China's property sector is sputtering. This as real estate developers have defaulted on their debts and that's prompted a sharp decrease in housing construction. And that's not all. Xi faces challenges outside China as well. Beijing's unfair trade practices have roiled China's relationships with partners. Moreover, China's human rights abuses in Xinjiang, the impacts of a draconian national security law imposed on Hong Kong, and worsening military intimidation of Taiwan has fueled a narrative of China's international threat. Blame Xi's personality cult or the current economic and strategic challenges there are reports of internal opposition to Xi Jinping's third term within the CCP. Clearly, for Xi Jinping's governance in China, the next five years will require a great deal of crisis management.